We don't say it's a Gujarati temple, it's a Hindu temple, but predominantly um, the, Guj the people who come here to worship are Gujaratis. It's not exclusively for Gujaratis. We get uh, many non-Gujaratis who come for certain festivals. They come for darshan of the deities. They may even come to sit in the discourses. But it's not a mandir for Gujaratis. But many Gujaratis come to worship here. <laughs> Let me just tell you a little bit about uh, the history of this temple. So this temple was opened in 1995 by His Holiness Pramukh Sai Maharaj, who was then the spiritual leader of the BAPS Swamrain organization. So Pramukh Sai Maharaj, he had a vision which was given to him by his guru, Yogi Ji Maharaj, in 1970. So, in the 1960s and early 1970s, a lot of Gujaratis, they came from East Africa to UK and also specifically to London. And then, we all know, history tells us that uh, the Ugandan exodus happened in 1972 and thousands, literally thousands of East Africans from Uganda, also Kenya, also Tanzania, migrated to London. So since that time, um, Pramukh Sai Maharaj, he inspired the devotees, encouraged the devotees, look for a place, look for a place, look for a place. But after looking at many different sites, this site came up for sale, I think in 1989 or 1990. It was acquired. And with the permission of the local council, uh, with the blessings of our gurus and swamis, this temple, um, the work commenced in 1992, completed in 1995. So Brent became home to this traditional temple. It was the first traditional temple probably outside India 